Are you struggling to teach your students online during lockdown? Are your students bored as your lecture goes for the worse in online? Here I am going to give you a demo on Quizlet, a study application that allows students to study information via learning tools and games. Open a browser, uh, whether it is Google, Chrome, Firefox, or whatever it may be. Just uh, type Quizlet in the search box. Yeah, then click this Quizlet uh, learning tools and flashcards for free. First, you want to sign up using your Google account or Facebook account. It's uh, free to log in, and if you want uh, some more features in this, uh, you need to upgrade by paying some amount. But uh, you can access many features without upgradation. So let's uh, see this without uh, upgradation feature. So now I'm going to log in using my Google account. So I have already signed up here. So if you want to create a class, click here and uh, type the name of your class and give the description of your class and also type your school name or uh, your college name and then click uh, create class. Uh, now I don't want uh, to create a class. Instead, I'm going to create a folder. So to create a folder, just click this uh, create button. And a new study will appear. Uh, type the title which you want to teach your students using flashcards. So now I'm going to show you how to create this. So I'm using now here. So I want to teach my students now. So I'm typing here as now. And then uh, enter the description for it. the main part comes here so here uh, this is the flashcard one enter the term which you want to teach your students first so now i want my students to know about noun first so i'm typing noun here uh, in the definition it will suggest uh, automatically the meaning of the term if you feel comfortable you can select this or you can type your own definition i'm going with the this uh, definition person place or thing if you want to add more uh, flashcards uh, you can type here i type here uh, the major types of norms yeah. and uh, also if you want to add image instead of giving description click this uh, image button and it would automatically suggest you some images see here so major types of norm i have typed here let's uh, suggest uh, some of the pictures here so if you want to upload your own image, you need to go for that upgrade uh, process and you, you need to pay some amount of money. Uh, likewise, you can create a mini uh, flashcards using this by adding add card. You can create uh, some more flashcards and now click this create. It's now saved into your account. So now it's saved into your account. And if you want to share this uh, with your students, you need to copy this link and you should need to give them through email or, uh, else, or else you can share this on Google Classroom or else uh, it's better to copy the link so I have copied it and I uh, have paste it in the email. and now I can send this to my students also so when they click here on um, this screen this screen will appear for them and if they click on this particular word they can see the meaning of it person place or thing if you want to move to the next they want to here so major types of noun so proper noun common noun abstract noun collective noun so after this if you wish to see how your students will learn you need to click this this the learn button so from this uh, your students will learn those terms with their meaning so here it comes like this proper noun common noun abstract noun collective noun so here there are two options if you give uh, more it will also appear here so i will need to select the students need to select any one of these so these are the major types of terms. yeah it's correct then the next question person place or thing what is a person place or thing it's now yeah, correct. 
So even I can type here answer. You don't need to click this answer. Yeah, it's correct. So what is this? Player person face or thing? It's noun. See, if I type an, uh, instead of noun as nouns, it will definitely mark as a wrong answer. So see, study this one. So it suggests me to study for another time. So uh, this it, it's not nouns. It noun. So what I I was correct. Press any key to continue. Or so move to the back. Then click uh, right. Yeah. Here you, know, you can make your students uh, to write and practice. So see here, uh, the definition is given here: person, place, or thing. And they need to type the answer. It's now. So when they type the answer, so they can write and practice. So they can write here and they can practice the exact word uh, without any spelling mistakes. When you click this spell button, you can view a speaker like symbol. Yeah, yeah, it is. The speaker like symbol. When you click this, major types of noun. When you click this, the exact words will be pronounced uh, for which uh, uh, the description will be given as a clue below. I can check how uh, my mentioning skills are good. At last, at last, test. By clicking this, you can check the answers of your students. So that will be our uh, written questions. Or match the following questions and other types of questions. Quizlet also gives the option to set these flashcards to play. When you click this match button, you can match the exact terms with their definition. So I need to give start game. Yeah, yeah. So proper noun, proper common noun, object noun, correct noun. What are they? Yeah, major types of noun. So person, place, or thing. It's noun. Gravity is also a form of game, and you can also. I need to type the answer. Here is an option for you to go live, where you can ask your students to play this game. So I'm clicking this create game. So I'm clicking individuals now. So which type do you want? So you need to select. I'm going to select this. So the students they need to type this display code in the wislet.live website so there is a particular website wislet.live that the uh, players the students they have to type this code but remember when all students uh, join together then after that only you can start the game so it's waiting for two plus players and if you go, go for the group event it will ask you to join more than uh, four or five members so after that only you can start the game Thanks for watching this video. If you are new to our channel, subscribe it. If you like this video, hit the like button and share this video with your friends and colleagues. And if you want me to give some other demo sessions, you can also type them in the comment box below. Let's meet on another video. Bye.